But I'm here how to learn how to go milk. How to go to milk? How to go to milk. Yeah, yeah. I've never done any kind of milking, so that should be really interesting. <laughs> but thanks to my best friend, Steph, and her daughter, Lily. I will Lily. try it. Yay! <laughs> Wish me luck. All right, so first we will be giving the bottles to the babies because uh, Lupin and Lily are not their mummies. What? Lupin really? and Lily? Yeah. yeah, they're not their mummies. Mm -hmm. These are kids I know. from other dogs. I think each one else, you're like my cutest little yeah. one there. Best price. Price, they super bad. 20 key. So see Applejack. Applejack. Sugar Shack. Sugar Shack. This is a maple. Maple? How do you know which one is maple? Uh, point uh, blanc. Oh, thank you. Okay. Sugar shop. Forget there. Okay, so for Guys, number one. Maple. Okay. Which one is this? Sugar shack. Sugar shack. And this one? Don't forget tomorrow, sugar shack. Okay, so you're going to give a bottle. <gasps> which one? Yeah, which one? Which <gasps> one do you want? This is this okay. one. Pies. Pies. I know pies. Now this is goat's milk, but it's a powdered milk because um, <laughs> we need the milk off of the uh, look at, for the. Look at Sugar Shack. We need the milk off of uh, Lily and Lupin, which they are not their moms. And we're using it for ourselves, and they wouldn't drink off of them anyway. So look at Sugar Shack. He's Sugar a greedy Shack one. is really greedy. Hi, it's time to go. Get down, get down. Oh my God, it's a bueno, so awesome, it's bueno. How long, how long do you drink? Do you think you Three drink? times a day. Three times a day. Is this like a formula or? This is a formula. If you back up a bit, if you just back up a bit, I'll get you more in the. Uh, this is Fries. And she, the reason why she's called Fries is Fries face. Actually, she she looks like a Fries face. You're so It's a French pretty. expression, folks. Oh my God, you're so pretty. Also, I think I like you. I spotted you right from the start. Also, these guys have orchard names like Highs is means strawberry, sure. and Apple Jacks, Whoops. Sugar Shack, and Maple. Maple is going to be named after another homesteading family, and their homesteading channel is named Maple Berry Farms. So, where'd you get these? Maple these is little. going to be called Maple Berry. Where'd you get these little? Uh, From the feed store. And who are you? Sugar Shack. And this is maple. Yay! Maple, go back in. No, no, no go back in, guys. No way, Kai. They da, don't want to go back in. No way. Okay, my first cookie, my first cookie. Go away, I need to go. Woo! Yeah. Wow, so what we do so first cool. is we we I just kind of sweep them. out. We sweep off our milk stand, which people can't see right now. If you want to put this on me. Yeah. Um, the thing I have to watch is not to get it in the baby's water. That's right there. Where's the water? Okay. See, like, no, that's the water to, to clean them off. There's a little bit of hay in there. That's okay. Then now. So, okay. So now They're we're going to bring the milk. big girls in. Let me fix this for you, Lily. If you, um, there you go. If you can put the camera on here, this is, um, it it's a fermented, it's soaked grains. What it is, is their um, sweet feed, uh, black sunflower oil Whoa. seeds. Are you okay, They're Lily? They're ready to be done, eh? Yeah. So right now, Lily Lily actually isn't supposed to be up here first. Lupin oh, is the first you. one. Lupin? Yeah. Come Lupin. on, Lupin. Lupin. Oh, hey, Lupin. Oh, hey. Come on. Come on, girl. Lupin. So, loop the loop goes up. There you go. And uh, we don't even, this is how fantastic this is, because we don't even really tie them up or put them, like you're supposed to put the head of the goat in here, right? 
and then you put that over. Yeah. We don't. They're they're very good. They're very good girls, so we don't need to do that. And uh, I am going to link a video up here on um, what happened Whoa. with our last girls, just so you see the difference in milking with. Uh, it was with uh, Mocha, actually. Yeah, Mocha. I remember was. Really you can give her some grain. Honey. Mocha was really difficult. Yeah, yeah. She's a. I loved her. She was a hard head. I go. Yeah. Come on, Lily. And she is. So too. first, you always. We're teaching Tindy how to mill goats here. So first, yeah, you always know. make sure that the udder, the whole udder, is completely washed. I'm sorry. What's the udder? Ow. The udder is. I'll show you. Okay, this is what she wants, honey. Okay. Here. Right here. Here, Lily. Come on, Lily. Like that. I think Lily wants to be milked. Lily of the valley. So. You need to, what I put in the water is I put a little bit of biodegradable natural dish soap and I will put a little bit of bleach just a little splash and I will wash the complete udder the udder if you bring the camera down to me you could actually take this off and okay so basically the big bag is the udder and this here this is the teats Okay. Okay. Yeah. And I can actually. We should put a light on there. I make sure, like, I'm gonna be shaving this, because this can fall into the milk. It doesn't matter if it's well washed. So you just wash your whole udder, and I'm using warm water with a bit of biodegradable natural dish soap and some bleach, a, just a little dash of bleach. Mm -hmm. Okay, and you know you massage it a bit, and then you're gonna want to just let out a couple of squirts like that. The first few squirts and then you use your sterile jar if you have a bowl you can use a bowl yeah we normally bring a bowl but these are good these girls are so easy so and then you just milk okay you're you're uh -huh. supposed to squeeze watch my fingers you're supposed to squeeze I bring them down one finger at a time bring the milk down so you let the pocket fill you let the teat fill yeah, the milk is in the other, and you don't want it to go back up into the other. So, so bringing it down like this firmly, firmly, okay, firm enough. And she's got really good teeth. So, and even in a small jar like this, like she's good to just aim. And normally you'll do this in a bucket, you know. Right. But her teeth are just really good so because it's in a little mason jar like that we're gonna one teat at a time did you only bring one jar i did we get about a liter a day between the both of them because they all they were almost dried out and we just we're, we're bringing Sometimes them back into milk there so you didn't bring jars. and that's why we're feeding them the alfalfa and all the uh so, Tindy, you want to give this a try? Okay, now I'm try. nervous. Don't be nervous. There's a first, okay, Ooh. first you're going to want to put your hands into that water. You want to make sure your hands are sanitized. Where's the water? Right there. Okay, hold on. That's really good, yeah. uh, You want to keep the camera on, Tindy? There you go. Okay, Tindy's okay. got clean hands. Clean hands are always very important. Oh my God, why did you make it so look so easy? Okay, so there you go, Tindy. You don't want so to bring your hand. from up to down. Yeah, there you go. Oh my God, That's this okay. is not so easy there. I know, uh, it always looks easier, but you get the hang of it after a while. So that one's probably empty. Okay, wait, Lily. Okay, I'm getting the. After you can do Lily, she's more easy and she's more full. But she looks almost empty. Okay, yeah. So what I'm going to do now, see? Yeah, she's empty. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to. Not... I'm gonna work her milk, okay? I'm gonna yeah, produce milk. Hang on. There's more coming. Yes. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna want okay. to produce the milk, okay? So you go up without bringing any milk up into the udder and you're producing it. Just like, you know, when we breastfeed our kids, when we nurse, the more they nurse, the more you produce. So when she's empty like this, because this is what I'm trying to do. See, I'm only getting a half a liter right now. I'm trying to bring her milk up, so I'm gonna produce the milk, so I'm gonna, Continue, even though she feels empty, I am continuing to milk to make more milk. 
Okay, I get it. Okay. Okay. And we're, how we're long do you? We're producing milk now. Yeah. Okay. See, there's a little bit that came out. Yeah. Well, it doesn't. It doesn't matter if it's not really coming out as long as you're doing the movement that is right. That is like if it was a kid sucking on her. You're producing, so it's going to give the signal to her glands or to her hormones and her milk production system to produce more milk. Oh, okay. I see what yeah. you mean. Okay, so now you can take the um, the jar away. Okay. So what you do after is you're going to want to clean towards downwards. Okay. So because you, okay. you don't want to bring any um, dirt milk. back in. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Like this. and um, and then we have this special tea bomb that I made with coconut oil. Yeah, coconut oil. Two drops of tea tree. Where are you pointing the camera? Two drops of tea tree. Four, maybe four or three drops of lavender. One drop of peppermint. Yes. And uh, no, I, it was actually two and drops. Where, where do I put it on? Just melt it in your hands because this is raw. Um, and coconut, coconut oil. oil. Yeah. So coconut oil is already antibacterial, antifungus. So it's going to help hydrate the teats and the udder. So you want to rub it on her teats downwards and on the whole udder. Yeah. And um, there's there's also rosemary oil in there. It smells lavender. really good actually. Yeah, it does very, it smells very nice. And it's, it's very good for her and it's gonna help prevent any bacteria. Yeah, I can see that. that. So okay I'll, guys, it's my should turn we put this back in to the show water? her how. Yep, that goes back in the water. Um, so okay. we're gonna take Lupin off of here. So I'm just gonna back her up. We're gonna switch the girls. They know the drill. Lily's going up. Keep the camera on. There you go. Oh, you hold on. Should we clean her? Yeah. So she needs to be clean. I'm gonna see you milk show, too. show me. Okay. So this one is a bit more rough because look, the teat is more full. Okay. So what you want to do here is the same process, but you just squirt. Squirt a couple times, right? Squirt two times. Did you get her whole udder, Lily? Yep. You, you're very, you cleaned it well. Yep. Okay. Right. This this Good. is Lily. Very Lily nice. is Lily's goat. She this was her present from a birthday Whip present. So she's Lily my godchild. Yes. Yeah, I'm so proud of her. Now you want so to... Lily gets to milk Lily of the Valley, and Lily's like a pro milker. You should see her with both hands. But did we clean her? Yes, we did. We cleaned her, and we let some loose milk right there on the stanchion before. We... Okay. All right, nice, Lily. I like milking. It's relaxing. It is relaxing. It's so serene. We do this at 6 o'clock every morning before going to school. I'm so proud of you, eh? Good aim. Not with this hand. Yeah, normally with a bowl we do both hands, but it's also okay to do just one hand at a time. And relax. And we only have two milk, two goats to milk. Sorry. So, are you gonna let Aunt Tindy try? Yep. Okay. Okay. Well, I don't know if I, my aim is gonna be as good as yours. It's okay. Give it a shot. Her others are more small. It's as good as so small. you yes. want to have here and then go down. Yeah, squeeze it down. Okay. I see what you mean. Oops. It's <laughs> <laughs> I think I need to get closer. Okay, I see what you mean. We gotta get up there. You kind of have to. You have to be firm enough, and you have to let the pocket fill, and then squeeze the milk out. Okay. Look. No, 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 you gotta no, let no, me do Lily. it. You gotta let me do it, Lily, because otherwise I won't know what I'm doing. You guys are laughing at me. Eh? We're not laughing at you. Tindy, you're doing very well, actually. That was how I was doing the first time. Actually, I don't know about that, Lily. I think you taught us all how to milk because mm -hmm. Nana Bev, she taught you well. Yeah. But the first time, first, first, first time I was like that with Nana. Okay. 
I don't know. It's just you do one at a time. Look, look at that. See how well I'm doing? You're doing a very good job. Yeah, her thing here is uh, you got to go up higher with her. Yeah. Get the milk, bring it down to the pocket, but you just, the, the, the most important thing is that you don't bring the milk up. It's going down. Yeah. So you bring it down and it's a firm, firm yet not rough grip. It comes, it comes with time where you just get a feel of it. Like I thought I was, and my hands have what the Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome, and like my hands get very bad and I, I think it's actually helping my arthritis and everything to milk to actually Well, I was going to say I have fine motor skills, right? um, so. carpal tunnel yep. and I'm feeling it. Yeah, but then when you do it for a while, you know, it's, it's like exercising, exercising the small muscles of your hand. Thanks. For how you hang on there, that's that's actually helping me. Mm -hmm. Hey, Lily. Yep. Wow, this is. Yeah, I can really see. I'm a little slow, am I? It comes. Yeah, but that comes with time. Compared to the two of you, because I'm afraid to hurt her. Mm, well, you're not going to hurt her. Is you have to be like I said, firm but not rough. So now I understand what people mean by doing two hands and going chuk, 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 chuk. Yeah. yeah, I just don't see myself doing that. I do that sometimes in the morning and it's like a rhythm and it's like a song, you know, and it just flows. You want to keep going there, Lily? Okay. But you kind of need a pail instead of a small jar like yeah. that. Yeah, I would have to agree. Wow, that was uh, not that easy. No, it's not, but... Good aim! We're gonna run out of space in that mason jar. Yeah, they might actually give you more than right, you Lily. Right, Lily of the Valley, and Lily of Let's Homestead instead. <laughs> now, I thought that goats would give you milk when they had babies. Yes, they both they kitted. So what what hap what's happening here? They've had their kids, but they are from a um, registered breeder. Okay. And what happens in this business and this type, they're they're show goats. Okay. They they actually pull the kids. Um, they don't do as much dam raising. Dam raising means raised by the the, the doe itself. Okay. Um, sometimes it's healthier because they get like. It's just a healthier, they, they actually pasteurize the milk before getting, giving it back to the kids because when they're just standing outside in the field or in the barn, the bacteria can get in there and whatever. Um, my personal thoughts on that is that I'm, I'm going to do a 50-50 thing. It, it'll depend on what goat, who's a good mom, who is not. Um, dam raising can be a good thing, could be a bad thing, all depending. Just like human beings, you know, you got good parents and you got good bad parents. Good job there. Lily, that was really nice. I think we're coming to the end almost, eh? We well, are. Yeah. I'm just uh, milking her uh, for more production. Because this is not where she, what she was giving when she was a... Uh, uh, Last year, actually, she was giving more to, um, to the lady that sold them to us. So... Sorry, we can't mention her name, guys. Well, we could mention her name. I don't know. We have to ask her permission. So if you keep going that way, are you trying to get boost her to get more milk eventually? Yeah, that's what we're doing. We're producing more, you know? Like, it's like us humans. The more they drink, the more you get the milk, right? Yeah. And, um... And it's not because the kids have been pulled. It is not. Now, a lot of people will probably comment on that, but, um... Other does that kids have been pulled are doing like uh, the, the the gallon of milk and plus 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 every mm -hmm. day, but we're getting uh, half a gallon from these girls every day. Every day. Yeah, every day. So that's not too bad. So. So morning, well, and, two morning and morning and night. No, right? half a gallon, sweetie. Morning and yeah, night. Yeah, yeah. We're in okay. here. We're in Wait, here. Wait, this is a half a gallon, right? No, that's a liter. Oh. We're we're here. Every morning at quarter after six, we get up at five thirty. We prepare everything. We come out here, and um, good work. And then the same time, twelve hours in between. Good job, Lily. 
So Very now she's nice going to wash her. You want me to do it or you're good? I'm good. Thanks, guys, for showing me. You're now welcome. we're going to go walk you. You're so beautiful. Isn't she? The lily of the valley. Where's the tea bowl? Hey, Lily. They're sweethearts. They're really sweet girls. We were just so blessed with them. Okay, so I just refiltered the co the the coffee, <laughs> the milk because I use a coffee filter in the other coffee filter because sometimes you could get a hair that would go through only the hair, not the gunk. But anyway, this is what uh, this is the way I do it is with a coffee filter and the other like reusable coffee filters. That is until I have enough money to purchase the real milk filter. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Take care. Till next time.